everybody, welcome back to Mega Man 64. I'm going to continue on with this one, at least for a little while longer. If it looks like no one is enjoying this at all, then I guess I will give it up. But I'm going to try to keep this one around 20 minutes this episode. But I know I've got several fights ahead, so... I'm going to try to get more action into this one than I got into the other episodes. Or into the first episode. It was like half an hour long. Okay, and a lot of it was it? intro. Once the decision's made, there's no turning back. Nothing less than 100%. And remember, it's more than just guns and ships. It's whoever has the most information that wins. Right? Great! We understand. You need to keep your costs and risks as low as possible, and stay on schedule. Those little Lego men would almost be cute if they aren't you constantly it. used for evil. Huh? What are you looking at? Huh. 90s fashion. Look at that neon pink and that giant hair. Ugh. You know, the 90s was a fun decade. Oh shit. Yeah, I forgot. These guys will run you the fuck over. These cars, no shit's given by them. Garbage fails or anything inside. Broken motor. See, I got a cleaner. I got the broken motor. I think I have everything to make the vacuum arm. I just gotta wait till Roll gets the... That uh, support vehicle up and running. Because she can't make anything, I think, until she gets that running. Which usually the broken cleaner you find somewhere in this town anyway. Somewhere in this part of town. Usually you don't find it in the trash can outside. Um, you can actually use these vending machines if you want to. They restore like... It's like a hundred zenny, gets you a pop, and it restores like one thing of health. You can go rooting through people's mailboxes too. That's what this is, is a public mailbox. I guess that's probably close to what they look like in Japan. Um, I'm looking for more trash cans. Does it say 1963 on the wall? It sure does. Okay, there's a cop. Did my little tour around town. Time to go uptown. What do you want? You've been following me around all day, haven't you? Sorry, but I don't have time to play with you. Just stay out of my way, okay? She's not, she's with the bad guys, but she's not really that bad. It's her brother that's an evil dick. Professor Barrel? Yes, he's here. And a meeting with the mayor. Please wait one minute. Okay, so gotta go through this little cutscene where you go upstairs, you talk to your grandpa, and I guess he's your grandpa. No other reason I could think you'd be hanging out with some old dude. And the mayor, which turns out was like hey, one of his archaeology Mega Man. students. Come to check up on me, eh? Here, let me introduce you to the mayor of this island, Amelia. I'm Amelia. Nice to meet you. I'm an old friend of Professor Barrow. I worked as his assistant for a while, while I was in school. Yeah, that's something like that. Okay, she was his assistant, <laughs> it's a small not a student. World, isn't it? To tell you the truth. We've gotten reports that there are some pirates headed this way. I was asking the professor if he might have any idea what they're after. I'll bet anything they're after the legendary treasure supposedly buried on this island. There are a lot of stories about the treasure, but no one knows exactly what it is. Come on, I, I wish I could fast forward that, through this, but at the same time, if you guys want to know anything about story, I have I've to say. I've been in the this. digging business a long time. But I haven't been able to find out anything about this island's treasure except legends and myths. Look, Mega Man, 
I'll be here for a while talking with Amelia. So why don't you go back and keep an eye on Roll? Tell her not to worry about me, okay? See, there's a museum here in town, too. Like when you... ah, It's a dog! When you go on digs, sometimes you'll find, like, fossilized reaver bots and stupid stuff like that. And I can't remember if I've ever found everything. The museum wants, like, one of everything that you can find. I don't think I've ever found everything that they want. Wish I had those. You can get these skates that if you down on the C button, the down C button, it like lets you like power skate all around. Where are these people? Well, these are those kids that were being jerks to me earlier. Okay, I gotta go get the dog away from her. And then go talk to Roll. Okay, how do maybe I gotta try to talk to her. What are you staring at? I'm not a circus clown or something. Go on, get out of here. Okay, there we go. Don't you know you can't treat girls that way? That's what I was trying to get him to do, is talk to the dog so that the hey, dog will leave her alone. On. Down, boy. Down. Yeah, because dogs do that. They just give up right? what they're chasing and huh. walk away calmly. That's the way girls are in real life. Remember that, kids. Okay, still gotta go south. We gotta go find Roll. And I think south is to my left. That's east. Ah, I came out close to the door. I don't think I can go through the west or the east doors yet. I'm there anyway, so. No, no, I didn't. Like I'm sure I will, though. I wonder who they are. There, those ones. Huh? Doesn't sound like they're playing nice in there. I really want to get my vacuum arm up and running before I do any of these stupid fights. But that's not an option. Maybe at the end of this episode I'll get to. Uh, yeah. It's best to save with Mikey the monkey. Recharge energy. I know it was full, but just making sure. I don't know whose saves, whose the rest of these saves are, so. That's why I'm saving in slot 7. I know slot 7 is always mine. And I let my kids play this for a while, and I think they're the ones that filled up the rest of these slots. So. Hold it right there! 
You can't go in there. This area's closed off. Please, officer, let funny. us through. Our grandfather's in there and... Hmm? You can't go in either. It's dangerous. Got a gun for a hand. I think I'll be okay. What's happening? Those pirates have attacked the island. That's Just fine. like they said they would. I'll go blow them up. They're after the treasure that's supposed to be buried Let here. me go blow them up. Enough talk. You have to leave here. You're now. literally talking to someone that has a gun for Pirates. a hand. Pirates? They've occupied the gate over there. They're too heavily armed. We can't even get... My other them. hand throws landmines everywhere, so... Maybe I can do something. I don't know how he wipes. Mega Man, I'm going with you. No role is too dangerous. Let me handle this. But... All right. You look out for Gramps, okay? Wait, are you crazy? Wait, where do you think you're going? What can a single boy possibly do? I would actually like to see a re-release of this game done where they bring the resolution up. And keep the graphics the same. The graphics are fine. They get the job done. They're fine. But just bring the resolution and make it widescreen. And re I, I know there is a part two. Like, re-release this with part one, part two, and all on the same thing for, like, Xbox One or something. That would be awesome. Because this is a fun little game. Screw you guys. Get the key to the gate. One of the three servlocks has the key. They can pass it back and forth between them. So you have to figure out which one of them has it. Each of the three servbots, robots is unique, has different capabilities. Red is built for combat. Yeah, it shoots the shit out of you. Blue is built for speed. It's the fastest one. And yellow's got like a life bar that's two or three times bigger than the other. So you can shoot the shit out of him all day long. He's usually yellow's the first one I go for because it takes so much longer to kill it. Run, stupid fuck face. All right. Killed that serve bot. You don't have to kill him. It just makes me feel better to kill them. My buster wasn't maxed out. Then these guys, this fight would be taking a lot longer. Oh, he had the key. my buster wasn't maxed out, that fight takes a good 5-10 minutes. So sorry. You gotta chase them around, they run from you, oh, and you gotta chase them sorry. around, they like, ambush them at just the right places, and oh, the yellow no. one usually takes the longest to kill. Though it died Who pretty easy that? this time. Wait, wasn't that the same boy as before? He disabled the Bloomberg by himself? I don't understand. Whenever I think about him, I get this funny feeling. <laughs> yeah. Oh, forget it! Who he gives you a lady chug. It's all his fault! His fault! How dare he! I'll teach him not to mess with me or my kids! Here we go! Building up! Engage! <laughs> This thing blows up half the damn city. The quicker you kill this thing, the less... I think you end up having to, like, raise the money to pay for the rebuilding of the damn city. Thanks you! Thanks to you, everything's a mess now, isn't it? Huh? Aren't you the girl who's being chased by that dog? Shut up! I don't want to hear about that! Do you know what you've done? Huh? You're a lot dumber than you look. You should have known better than to If they were this game, they could probably re-release this on the Nintendo DS and it'd probably service, handle it fine. I suppose I could forgive you. I don't know, it's just my opinion. That way my I think it'd be good on the DS. Join up with pirates? I don't think so. <laughs> Alright then, forget you. 
Fine, see if I care. I gave you a chance and you turned it down. Don't come back crying to me later. Okay. This thing shoots like bombs everywhere and it'll blow down half the buildings in town. And at some point... Oh shit. At some point later in the game you have to... Like pay for damages, help them rebuild the town. So the quicker I get this bastard done the less money I'll have to raise to help rebuild town. I didn't even see how many buildings it destroyed. If any. <coughs> um, I I'm so... I mean, not bad. You're stronger than I thought. I'll give you credit for that. Miss Charles! For some reason, your little ships remind me of goldfish. It's not over yet. Don't think you've won. Next time, I won't be so easy on you. I'll make sure you pay for this. Let's go! Jackie! Okay. Talk to Mikey the Masturbating Monkey. Get recharged. Save. Always save. Okay, so I got one more fight to do. I think when I go in here towards City Hall, everything in here is under attack, Indications are too. that the mysterious group of pirates will continue its offensive for the foreseeable future. Recapping our top story of the day. At 2 o'clock this those mouth animations. the city center was attacked by a group Her mouth is either a Dorito who demanded or it's a little line. keys to the caves and tunnels Underneath Maybe it's island. a guitar pick because it's got the rounded edges to towards the back. Demands, and Her mouth could be a guitar under pick. Siege alone in City Hall. Local police are helpless in front of the power of the pirates' weapons. It may be only a matter of time before City Hall is destroyed. Hopes are rapidly fading as. I've just been handed this update, viewers. It appears that the robots and machines being used to lay siege to me have been destroyed by a single young boy and now that same boy has come through the gate and is heading towards city hall wait there he is i can see i know the him. stuff that gets He's destroyed really in this part alone. of town can this lone hero like if save the city mayor? hall or the police department well city hall gets destroyed you lose but if like the police station gets destroyed i think you have to pay to rebuild it Mission start! I'll ignore the serve bots for now. If I had my vacuum arm, I'd be raking in the money right now. The yellow ones will destroy anything that they run across. You there! Those yes, I know. Are being I gotta take out the things carrier. that are dropping them. You should go after that first if you want to stop them! Wish I had my power skates. They let you move a lot faster. Oh, that's the reporter. Thought it was another one of those things dropping. Okay. Police headquarters, I don't see any robots attacking. Just 
There's gotta be more robots around here, or mission would have already ended. City Hall. City Hall looks pretty safe. I think this is... Oh, there he is. He's trying to tear down this little two-story bungalow. Ooh, they fucked the bank up pretty good, but it's not tore down. Whoopsie. Things like the pet robot for the pirates. I think you've been fighting him again a couple of times. But in different forms, they like build different bodies and stick that head on them. I think this guy is the one he's in charge of the pirates, the Bond family. Hey, look at the clock! It's almost time for my favorite show! I almost missed it! Next story. City Hall was attacked by a mysterious group of assailants this afternoon, but their offensive was beaten back by an equally mysterious young boy, pictured here on screen. What? Who the heck is that blue boy? So Bond was defeated, but what about Tron? This is a potential disaster. We could end up losing a lot of money on this one. Oh, come on with the cutscenes. All right, it's obvious that I, Teasel Bond, will have to assume command. Who needs that key anyway? It might take and it might take some money, but who cares? I'll use my ultimate digging machine, the Marl Wolf, to dig up the treasure myself. And I won't let any little blue boy get in my way either. <laughs> huh? Wait a sec. Bond's probably okay. But what about Tron? Come on, evil man. Let me get to a place where I can save. Because I've, I've been at this one. I need to go save. Mega Man! You did it, Mega Man! Yep, sure Come did. Come on, let's go look for Gramps. Having that maxed out buster actually makes those fights a little too easy. I was expecting to actually have a fight fight. Mega Man! Roll! Sorry to give you a scare like that. Don't you worry, though. I'm as healthy as I ever was. <laughs> Half your head's been replaced by a piece of metal and one of your ears looks like it's a radio you, knob. Don't know how healthy you are. With your help, we were able to keep those pirates from getting the key to the ruins. Thank you. Amelia says she'll give us a digger's license as thanks for helping her. Now we'll be able to look for parts to fix the flutter. I know it's not much. But it's the least I can do for you. Excuse me. Your Honor, we got a new problem. Those pirates have started digging up the northern forest. What? 
They weren't able to get the key, so they must be going after the treasure directly. I'm amazed they go to that much trouble. Even if they are criminals, you've got to admire their persistence. Who knows what will happen if they get their hands on the treasure? Inspector, I want you to arrest them immediately. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so who do I gotta talk to? I wonder if the inspector will be alright. Okay. They intend for me to go Wait check minute, on the Mega professor. Man. Or not professor, the I'm inspector. Going with you. Okay, is the car up and running now? Because maybe Look, I can man. get my thing. I fixed the car the junk shop owner gave us. I may not have been able to get it fixed in time to help you before, but next time you can count on me. Yeah, and now you can use... I think you can use it for fast travel to places that you've already been. You just find where the car is parked at on each part of the map. Get in and it'll take you automatically somewhere else. Which is a nice feature. weapons like they did before. The inspector might have some trouble. Not to mention... Not to mention that the pirates are likely to steal everything if they get there first. Well, I think I better go help them. Yes, you be better go careful, help. Them. Mega Man. But that will be for next episode. Awaits Let's get through the all car. these. God. If you find some parts that you I think might the... be useful, I, I don't mind the cutscenes when I'm playing by myself, I'll but like when I'm recording, having to sit through them. Right. See you later. Dry... Something about it drives me uh, kind of crazy. Where the fuck am I going? I want to get in the back of Roll's van and see. Well, now she's not even here, right? Yeah, there she is. I want to see if she'll make me my damn vacuum arm. Let me tell you about what I can do for you. First of all, you can change your special weapons here, yeah. You can only use one special weapon at a time, so let me know when you want to switch. Also, it costs a little money, but we can enhance your special weapons here, too. Next, there's item development. I might be able to make something out of new things you find in the ruins. If you find something interesting, be sure to bring it back here, okay? Last but not least, we can use a support car to move around the island. Walkie-talkie. You can use it to call me anytime. Use it when you want me to pick you up in the support car. But there are a few places I can't get to in the car, so I won't be able to pick you up even if you call me, sorry. Okay. Item developed. Okay. I don't know if I got all the parts to make the vacuum arm or not. Nope. Didn't have all the parts. Um, never mind. I know I got the major parts of it, so that's no big deal. Energy charge. Save. for me to go through these doors over here. Apparently that monkey's name is Data, not Mikey the Masturbating Monkey. Surprise, surprise. Anyway, that's where I'm going to end this episode. If you guys liked, let me know. Hit the like button, leave a comment. If you guys want to see more of this game, let me know. I'd be more than happy to go through it. I do need to take apart my N64 controller at some point and freaking rebuild the... Uh, or drop in one of those drop in uh, replacement analog sticks because this one it this controller is in great shape but it's starting to get dead zones if you guys ever played an N64 you know what I'm talking about they get they're really bad about getting big dead zones in them because well they didn't really make the N64 sticks that durable they did with the GameCube ones though, so they improved Anyway guys, thanks for watching, hit the like button if you like, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye for now.